Hello guys, welcome back to Zagnab. Today we're going to be trying an unboxing and we are going to be doing fan mail. Excellent. Awesome. We're looking forward to this for the new year. That'll be great. He's Zach and he is Dad. And, and together, together we're Zach and Dad. Well, thank you so much for tuning in to those big TVs, to the Zack and Dads. Uh, we're just a father and son that love to do what we love to do. Uh, we are the place for food reviews, food challenges, and you can see the banner behind me. We love to have some good, clean fun as well. I had some unboxing today, so we're excited about that. So if you love what you see here, which we really do hope, and we do thank you for that, please uh, like, subscribe, and hit that bell and hit the all so you never miss so hit the bell and then hit that notification that says all so you never miss an incredible video that we're going to do matter of fact we are and you probably already know this already we are over 800 subscribers right mm -hmm. now and it's because of all of you and i'm talking about you not the person next to you yeah, you know so who you're looking just you just hit Yes, we just hit 800, and something my son said which i thought was so great on the last one send what did this I say? Huh? Yeah, I know. <laughs> Am I in trouble? Uh, actually, you don't even know about this. Uh, one of our subscribers said, uh, basically, when you said to share the link, yeah. uh, one of our subscribers said, I already did. Whoa. So that is great. Maybe that got us a pin couple of subscribers. Comment. So, um, yeah, that's true. I should pin that comment. Thanks for reminding me. And give it a heart. Uh, and, and I'll heart it. And I'll heart it. Um, but and yes. And you'll respond. And, and I always do respond. But yes, please share this link uh, with all your friends because uh, we would really love to go live and that would be great. So anyway, today, before we go to the unboxing, um, we do have a P.O. box. If you ever feel led to send us uh, fan mail or, um, or snacks from your neck of the woods, either here in the United States or all around the world, well, we got a Christmas card. I went to the P.O. Box and I was, I was pretty shocked. Uh, I got a Christmas card from one of our, I would say one of our close friends uh, in the YouTube world and has just become friends in general, and that is Big John TV. Uh, we've done many collabs with them. And, was uh, that like our first collab? Wait, was that? Or was that with our friend? Or I th Yes, it could have been or was it with Sean Techno? Oh, weird. They could have been Sean Techno. But anyway, Big John was one of the first. Anyway, him and his family uh, sent us uh, a Christmas card here uh, with uh, Big John. Oh, Big John. Well, of course. Uh, John, Jess, uh, Maddie, and Jamie, uh, their kids. It was just in, in Santa Claus is right there, of course. He's not part of the family, but he was there. Yeah. And then he sent us, which is, we're really excited about this. How come Santa didn't... Didn't wake us up at the night and say, hey, guys, I want to do this. I know. And then in the back it says, thanks for being part of our family uh, with Jess, uh, Maddie, John, and Jamie. So thanks very much. And then we also got a sticker. Uh, a sticker. They Here. do have. Let's let's put that right. Oh. oh. They do have. I actually don't. Yeah, I don't want to take it off yet. I wish it could stick there. But I do. Uh, they do have merchandise. So go over there. They do have merchandise Merch. that they're. We love to help each other out. So go over to their channel. Grab some of their merchandise, buy them all out, make them famous, and when they become famous, we all get helped on that. So, um, let me put that right there. Does that look good? Mm -hmm. All right. Now, the other thing, um, why don't you say where you got this from? I got this from my uncle. I hope nothing is damaged in there. Um, anyway, for his uh, Christmas gift uh, from my, uh, I only have one brother, so from my brother, uh, his uncle, um, and a shout out to my brother and his wife and their incredible kids, my nephew and my niece, love you guys, you know who you are, and a big shout out, big, 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 big shout out to, to that family. Uh, they, gave, um, they gave my son, Zach, uh, not an not a all, it's a subscription based snack box. And we're and, getting this every single week. Nah, no. yeah, I don't think so. I'm joking, no. And you're not getting it every single month. They just bought one. This is a subscription-based uh, snacks from all over the world, or as it says, all over the universe. Um, so what it is, it's... it's we got this from Mars. Yes, it is. There might be some Mars bars in there. Um, anyway, um, it's a box that is full of different foods from all over the world. Um, that's why it's called Universal Yums. And it is subscription-based, so you could get a monthly if you want, like Munch Pack, like 
Big John TV do a munch pack. Um, so, but no, we got this as a gift, so we consider it an unboxing, what we're going to do with it, and fan mail. So we're really excited about that. So anyway, why don't we open it up and let's get right down to it so we don't waste any other time. I already X'd all. Ah. Oh, oh, don't go right there. Okay. All right. Now, why don't you show them? We've got... It's a box just chucked full of different snacks from all over the world. So let's get right into it. All right, and then it comes with a manual that explains what it is. So what does that front say on there? It says, strain that to get you really like yes. graham, bitterty, um, garlic. Why don't you show the potato family? Potato chips. Okay, what this is, it, they're roasted garlic potato chips. An addictive, crunchy take on a Czech uh, holiday tradition. It's from Czech Republic. And, um, well, let's start with that one. Okay. Wait, and, are we doing all these? Well, we're going to do it quickly. Um, I don't want to make this into a two video. Uh, if you were to follow Czech tradition, you'd have to grab a bowl, fill it up with these garlic chips, head over. What did you just look at? My phone. Why? Oh, your phone? Mm -hmm. That's your phone. Yeah. yeah. He just got a. He just got a. What do they call those things? They call them uh, watches. He just got an iWatch uh, for Christmas. No, Apple Watch. Uh, Apple Watch. Sorry. Um, and he loves it, and it's really awesome, and it can do everything. Apparently, uh, does it tell time though? Uh, yeah. Anyway, um, let's see. You fill up with these garlic chips, head over at your holiday table, and then you put the bowl of these chips uh, on the ground underneath. Yes, you read that right. We're not kidding. Placing garlic underneath the holiday table is said to bring strength and protection to everyone in attendance. It probably would, with garlic, probably people would leave too with garlic. Makes sense to us. Um, so anyway, all right, uh, let's give these a chip it and a dip it for the garlic potato chips from the Czech it, Republic. Chip, chip it, it, dip it. it. Oh my. We're not going to rate all these because people aren't really going to be able to go out and get them. Very good. Very garlicky. V very good. I really like these. A very garlic taste though. Can mm -hmm. you taste it? Yeah. <laughs> wow, the garlic's strong. Very good. Oh, by the way, what we'll do is we'll put a link in the description where if you're interested in Universal Sums, Sums, Universal Yums, you can go there too and, and maybe get a box for yourself or give it as a gift like we got it or get a monthly uh, subscription with it too. All right, great. Let's put that there. Why don't you grab something else? We're going to keep on going here because we want to finish the box in this go video. This because it looks cool. All right, let me see the front of it. All right, why don't you say what it is? Um, it is chocolate. It says right there, actually. Oh. Oh, wait. Domino's gingerbread with fruit filling and ripan. Mmm. Yeah. dark chocolate. Yes, that too. Anyway, it's apple and dark chocolate Domino Steins. Domino Steins? Domino Steins. Um, four Stein. layers of festive German delicate. Delicious, delicious. Um, anyway, this was invented in 1936. Germany is now classic. Domin, Domin, Domino Stein has four essential parts. Uh, a base, which is gingerbread. Uh, a layer of tart jelly. A slathering of uh, apples. And a fluffy confection made of... Chocolate, dark chocolate. There we go. All right, let's try one of these. They look really good. Should we chip it, dip it? Mm -hmm. Or we can bounce it. Dip chip it. it, dip it, bounce it. Let me move that over so people... Anyway, yeah, they look like this. Looks like a cute uh, here. That kind of looks weird. Ooh. It looks... Look at it. Look at it. Why it looks so weird. How about this one? Look at that, the layers. Yours doesn't look that like... Oh, you probably ate it from the top. I ate it from the side. Oh, yeah. You can definitely see the layers here. Of the germ of the gingerbread, mm -hmm. of the apple, and of the chocolate, or I think that yeah, really good. Graham Go Germany! It. All right. Gramps has texted. Who did? Gramps. Oh, the Gramster! Is it something we can say on air? No. All right. Woo! I guess we can't say it on air, Grandpa. Sorry. Oh, is it? Oh, he probably wants to know if your socks arrive for Christmas. The socks he ordered for you for Christmas. Yeah, I'm wearing them. All right, great. Excellent. All right, great. Why don't you grab another one? 
are what these are egg yolk yes yeah, salt popcorn. you are correct uh salted egg yolk popcorn wait what are these well let's just do this one first let's just do this one you're your mind is all over the place. Anyway, what these are is, uh, guess what country this is from? Africa? Yes. No, you're not even close. Anyway, these are Taiwan's most egg-cellent holiday tradition. Uh, in Taiwan, nothing says time to celebrate more like eggs. Egg dumplings, called, uh, called zangzi, are a staple of summertime dragon boat festivals. Baklava. For the or What was that big thing that we kept talking about? Was that the girl, or the... The, uh -huh. it, it was the girls' festival, wasn't yeah. it? Like the month of the girls' festival. So almost like this, Japan, or no, this is Taiwan, though. Taiwan. Um, anyway, uh, let's try these out. I don't need to keep reading everything about that. So anyway, these are salted egg yolk, egg yolk popcorn from Taiwan. Yep. They really know how to seal the deal on these Whoa. things. So is Grandpa okay, though? Is he going to make it? Mm, I don't know. Oh, man. I hope he's going to be okay. Otherwise, this video will be short. Bunch of grabs. Wait, I was, expecting, <laughs> I was expecting them to be like chips. Oh, this. no. They look like regular popcorn. I was not looking forward Actually, it smells to this really good. Because, look, like, I thought they were going to be like chips. Oh. Like, oh, smell it. It actually smells like really buttered popcorn. Oh, yeah. It really is good. Oh, let me. This garlic. Very garlicky Garlic. smell too. Very garlicky hey, smell. And this very chocolate. chocolatey <laughs> smell. All right, but yeah, they look like regular popcorn. Okay, so let's dip it. That let's are dip it. that are buttered. Whoa, spicy. Get out of here. Whatever. Are you but serious? To be honest, I don't really like it. The garlic chips I really like, the chocolate Ooh, I really like. Buttery. No, I think it's not butter. I think it's that egg you're tasting. Yeah. I actually don't think it's bad. I think it's actually very sweet. Not an egg fan. I think it's very sweet like a dessert. Almost like a dessert kind of a popcorn. Like with um, dessert stuff on it. So, not an But egg it wasn't your favorite fan. thing. All right, pick out another one. This is your box. You pick them all. All right. This one will be interesting. Scotland turkey and stuffing flavored potato chips. Does it say from where? Scotland? Scotland! Scotland. Yes! Scotland! That is where Land my Scots. my grandma, my grandma on my dad's side, my grandmother came from Edinburgh. Um, I don't know if you're if you're if you're from Scotland, I think either the road or the neighborhood was called Taylor's Place. Taylor's Place. Taylor was, or Taylor's I'm Place. Taylor's Place. Uh, but yeah, my grandma came from there, uh, came literally from Scotland when she was just a little girl. And she even went back a couple times. Um, you know, that's where I got, I don't have it now, but that's where almost all my, that's where all my kids got their red hair from. Where did the gray come from? <laughs> uh, from you kids too. Uh, I, they got, this is here, they got their red hair from me. I got my gray hair from them. You see how we kind of exchanged their colors there? Anyway, uh, so Scotland's cool. All right, so anyway, it is uh, roasted turkey and stuffing potato chips. Um, does any food scream ho hooray? hooray? It's the holidays as much as stuffing and uh, turkey and stuffing. For fo you want to open it? For folks across the pond, as they say. Um, let's see. For folks across the pond, nearly ninety percent of locals have a roasted turkey at the center of their Christmas feast. So that's kind of something like we do for Thanksgiving. They do you, they do it for Christmas. This is a beauty. Ooh, a good one. Now, let's wait. Let's now, us fooders, we know everything about food. Oh, yeah. yeah. Us oh. fooders. Oh, us fooders. <laughs> Some people say foodies. No, no, no. It's really fooders. Yeah. Um, anyway, it gives a whole history of it. Um, so, we'll see it. Let's see. Chip it. Dip it. Dip it. Oh, and you can tell there's some seasoning on it, too. Oh, yeah, be careful because of your braces. I don't know if I can taste the turkey, but I can kind of taste the stuffing. What do you think? Well, hey, well he goes for the next one. Give us a thumbs up if you um, love trying new food, like we're doing right now. And then what is your go-to foreign food? Um, what is your go-to foreign food? For me, it would be either French fries or French toast. Uh, my foreign food. And those are both from France. Um, and those would be my favorite foreign foods.
You know what I mean? Yeah, right. Um, I don't know, but anyway, we, we, yeah, yeah, yeah. What about you for foreign food? Okay, all right. And then are you on team? We're going to have a friendly little, I want to see what our comments are going to be like here. Um, it depends probably what size of the pond, what side of the pond you are. <laughs> anyway, are you on team cookie? Or are you on team biscuits? Or are you on team chip? Or are you on Team Crisp? I'm on Team Chip and Cookie. We want to know. Yeah, oh, on our side of the pond, we are cookies. No, I've had both of them. Cookies and chips are just better overall. Can you give me an apple? <laughs> <laughs> you want another napkin? Man, you're not making a lot of friends, my son. <laughs> no, so we do love our, our UK and our UK friends and all over in that area. So anyway, why don't you grab... Um, so those are okay. What did you think of these? Oh yeah, by the way, but, uh, do you like uh, biscuits by themselves, or do you like them with gravy? Ooh, you mean cookies with gravy on it? No, biscuits with gravy. Okay. Yeah, we I just see. had this like two weeks ago. I do love biscuits and gravy. I love it. Especially sausage gravy. Oh, and that is so great. Sometimes I like biscuits with jelly. Mm. Mm. You just cut them with a knife and then... And then the gravy over that? Yeah. So biscuits, jelly, and gravy? Wow. So anyway, quickly, what did you think about this? It's good. It was okay. All right. All right, what do you want to pick next? Oh, hey, biscuits what? and gravy. Oh, wow, whoa, no. sweet. Uh, um, anyway, why don't you show the family uh, the cover of that? Oh, this got wrecked. Oh, it did? Uh, probably in shipping. Why don't you show the family that one? Okay. All right, what this one is... Torta Polvoron? Shortbread with uh, powdered uh, sugar topping? Yeah, yeah, Spain's favorite Christmas cookie. Can you say that again? How is that pronounced? I don't know. I think it's Torta Polvoran. Pol Torta Polvoran. Spain's favorite. Oh, yeah, and then they have some Spanish right here. Shortbread with powdered sugar. Oh, good. Excellent. Imagine getting dust for Christmas and being excited about it. Yay! In Spain, that's often the case. Spain's favorite Christmas cookie, the Polvoran, yeah, yeah, they gets its name you from You can tell they like cookies more than biscuits. Due to how it crumbles. All right. Oh, my goodness. It did crumble. It really <laughs> did crumble. It is dust. Now you can see that. Looks like a powder cookie. Wow, it smells really good. You know what? They should have, like, this big rock. Ooh. How when you eat it, you just earn. Do it again. You should have a what? Earn. Ooh. Arr. All right. Chip it. Dip it. Mmm, it is good. Kind of dry. Wish I had something to drink now. But it was really good. I liked it. It was, it was, what'd you think? Well, if you're thirsty, you're in luck. I don't think it came with the drink. All right, next one. Because we have no drink in this box, unfortunately. We do Man, love I drink. I wish I could know what this was, but it's in a different language. I think they all are. No, let's do that, because right, okay. I'm already there. All right, why don't you show the family the cover there? This one is Cruton. Crudenoten cookies. Crudenoten cookies. Crudenoten cookies. They're from the Netherlands, and it's the number one spice cookie bite size. Um, ever wondered why spice cookies go hand in hand with the holidays? Yeah. So for so many. Yeah, we'll thank the Dutch. The spices Thanks, in these Dutch. cookies. Yes, thank you, Dutch. We Dutch love you. Uh, the spices in these cookies used to be as valuable as gold. Until what? and then until I don't know. They, <laughs> these are millions of dollars. Right here. Everything we're making that, profit. There. Uh, yeah, I mean, wow. I mean, we could sell this box for millions. Anyway, it's the gift. That every food's on earning. Oh yeah, every one of these comes with a history of it, and so I'm not gonna. I I'm not gonna read everything about it. So anyway, this will be. This oh, will be, oh dear my God. God. So my again, God. See. this is crude noten. Oh, Cru nice accent. Krutenogen. <laughs> Krutenogen. Anyway, Netherlands spice cookie. So let's see. Should we chip or dip her? Chip, chip it, dip, dip it. it. Mm. I like those. They're actually better than... I like those better than the torta pulverans. What the var... Mm. Those are really good. All right, pick another one. We got to keep going here. We're Not that. This looks weird. Sorry if I'm not. Uh, the 
Oh, it's too okay. late. We've offended everyone. I don't <laughs> think anyone's watching anymore. All right, show the family. All right, these are coca dusted. Oh, another dust. Coca. I should gold. say that before every video. Sorry if I. Sorry if I offend you. Yeah, we should. After before every video, we should just say, oh, "Hope we're not offending you," because we probably will to someone out there. So. Okay. Anyway, these are coco dusted chocolate truffles. France's most France's France's most popular and uh, Christmas gift. Uh, to France, we forge specifically the. Um, Mm -mm. And then a lot of other, a lot of history. So anyway, we're going to get right into it. Uh, these are cocoa dusted chocolate truffles from France. Mm. I thought you would have had that open while I was doing this so we can get right into it. Okay, what is this? It is, I thought I said it like three or four times. <laughs> it's cocoa oh. dusted chocolate truffles. It's coal. Coal. <laughs> Okay, got one. Oh, actually, oh my goodness, it feels like, well, I don't, actually, I don't know if I totally want to say what it looks like. Uh, <laughs> okay, uh, now we have to um, say that before every video. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, it looks really weird. Um, it, it it looks weird. It it, it, feels, it feels weird. weird. Okay, let's, anyway, let's just get into it. All right. That's good. Yeah, that's good. Okay. It tastes like a cocoa powdered truffle. If it didn't stain your fingers, it might be. It was good. If you're from France, again, we're not... If you're... Don't let it offend you. I'm sorry, okay? It just looked a little... looked a, It looked like an emoji of, of some sort. <laughs> if you know what I mean. All right, what's okay. this one? Salted caramel fudge, and judging by the flag on oh. the bottom right, it looks like it's from Australia. No! Mm, show the family! Oh, did I offend someone? Yes! <laughs> oh. All of our UK friends! Oh. This is salt, uh, sea salt, can you get sea salt and caramel fudge, a sweet and savory take on English Christmas fudge. Tis the season for fudge, fudge in England. So we got England. biscuits. And then we got cookies, and then we got crisps, and then we got chips. And now we and got... Now, and now, what What did that say? Fudge. And now it's, it's fudge, and now it's caramel. Uh, Are you on team fudge, or do you call it team caramel? I think it's those are two totally different things. It says salted caramel. Can I even? Yeah, have, yeah but fudge is... Wait, can it... I even have these caramel? I, oh, I, I mean, don't think these so. fudges... Is it caramel, or, or are you on team caramel, or on team caramel? Or are you on team biscuits, or are you on team biscuits with gravy? Ooh. Or biscuits I, with jelly. No, can you I can't have, have this. No, I, I, fudges? Well, this is fudge. Let me try, let me try one. Chip it, dip it. Let me try first. Again, with braces, you might have to exit out of this one. Mm. Mm. How's the... Wait, so is it... It's pretty you, much not a, it's, it a fudge. It's pretty or much a like a fudge biscuit. Would you call it fudge or caramel? You no, know, those are two separate things. Fudge and caramel are two separate things. It's a no. it's a caramel flavored fudge. No, is it's what a, it's saying. It's a fudge flavored caramel. Come on, man. All right. We probably have half of our people already tuned out by now because this is too long. But we're almost getting there. Oh my goodness, we have four things. All right. Take. This let's let me grab this. All right, this what with this is, with this is the Alpine nut cake. Say that three times fast. This Alpine nut cake. Alpine nut cake. Kite. Okay, you said it twice. Guys, is it cake or is it honey? Ooh, those are two separate things, little son. <laughs> um, th this is crumbly nutty pie straight from the Swiss Alps. So this is from Switzerland. And and we wanna let you guys know: Are you guys on team? Subscribe or on team comment or team comment. <laughs> some people say it differently. Yeah, yeah. Some say subscribe. Some say comment. I've co I've I've commented on this video with notifications on, and I have subscribed to this channel a number of ninety six times. Oh, all right. yeah. Or are you on team like, or are you on team thumbs up? Mmm, that one's a good one. That one's a good one. That one's a good one. Alright, here we go. Is this, is this a team, uh, 
biscuit with gravy, or is this an onion? I don't know. It doesn't. Yeah, it'll, it's interesting. It's gonna make you cry. Uh, uh, ooh, oh. ooh, there's a surprise in the middle of this oh. one. Wow. Okay. Uh, Smell it. Doesn't like that. <laughs> give it a good. Give it a good smell. <laughs> Why did I break it? It does really look, no, what it is, it's it's a nutty pie. It's a nutty pie. Okay, I need it from you. With, what? All right, we'll just leave it here, but it's a nutty pie. It looks a little disgusting in the middle, but it really, it almost looks like a pecan pie in the middle. Looks a little weird, but Wait, I think what it's country funny. is this from? This one is from Switzerland. Are you guys on Team Switzerland? Or are you guys on Team, okay, forget it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Chip okay, it, okay. dip it. What is I, it like hot? It. I like it. Why are you doing that with your hand though? What are you talking about? That was a good nutty pie. Okay. Filled with sweet caramelized walnuts and hazelnuts. It's addicting. Alright, let's keep going. Oh, just hold it up to the family. Wait, this is. It's a chocolate cream bandero! Bandero from the country of Italy. Italy. Um, Italy's beloved holiday sweet bread, plus gooey chocolate. So, anyway, why don't we open it up so we can hurry up and eat it? Bombs. Yo, hey, let's go. Oh, deeper, ow, deeper, come on. Ow. What happened? I got injured on this one. Oh, I think Grandpa just texted oh, me again. Really? Yeah, tell him it'll be a little later. All right. Ooh, this smells really good. This is Pandoro. I don't know what Pandoro is. Cake with, with a cocoa cream. Smell, looks, smell that. Smell that. I know, it's really good. Oh! Like a lava cake. Why did you have <laughs> I don't know, because I want the family to see in the middle. Anyway, it's like a cake with okay. some chocolate in the middle. Okay. Oh, that's chocolate. All right. Okay. That's <laughs> Okay, we can All right, just chip it. edit out like everything. Chip it, dip no, it. No, it's like we're editing out everything. And it's like, hello guys, welcome back to Zach. And, well, uh. <laughs> this is really good. <laughs> By far, it's the best thing I've had in this box. By far. It's bready. I will eat the rest of that easily. Very cakey. It's bready. Oh, it's chocolate. I love it. It's uh. It's like biscuits with babies. It's, it's uh. It's a crisp. It, well, it's crispy. Well, I wouldn't even say that. I'd say it's chippy. Chippy? Or is it chirpy? Is it chirpy or chippy? I. It's biscuit and gravy. Ooh, I don't know if you can have these. Looks within the front of that. Show the family that one. Oh. What this is mocktail. Whoa. Mocktail bonbons. Bonbon. Show the family. I am so pretty they can see the front. Show the family here. So anyway, celebrate New York or New York. New Year's Eve. I thought it was gonna say New York something. Anyway, celebrate New Year's Eve with the UK's juiciest pub flavors. Whoa. I, I don't know if he should drink it. He's not twenty one yet. Thirsty. If you're English, oh. eat. Oh, there. Who's gonna clean that up? Oh, uh, okay. I'm anyway, <laughs> if you're English, which is eight and eighteen or over, odds are you'll head to your favorite pub to ring in the New Year. Wait, eighteen? I guess. I, can you be like here? You have to be twenty-one. So, in I'm I'm assuming that in the UK, just 18. imagine this. Oh, I, I'm studying for a for a for a test on in high school. It's my finals, and I have to do it. Let me just go to the bar. <laughs> It says, parents, though, don't worry, there's no alcohol inside. Really? Yes. Where? That's right there. But with these British cocktail, or mocktail. How does it mocktail, know that I think it's saying mocktail, like they're mock. It's like a mock. It's not real. It's a mock of the cocktail. So, like, mocktail bonbons. Uh, the pub near, da 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 Sip on a fruity peach, bellini, tequila, sunrise, or pucker up for a cranberry cosmo. All right, let's try these non-alcoholic mocktail bonbons. All right. Oh, wow, they smell really fruity. Really, really fruity. All right, let's get going on these. Uh, why don't you grab one, and we'll we'll go to town. Okay. Uh, hopefully, you won't get a buzz off this. One. All right, here we go. Chip it, dip it. Oh, I got to suck on. Yeah, you're with your braces. Don't chew down yet. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Is it crisp or chips? Just 
Yeah, what are these? Are these chips or crisps? Help us on these. No, it's a candy. Now, are you on team candy or are you on team biscuits and gravy? Mm, I'm not going to stay here for the whole thing. Are you guys on team uh, mocktails or are you guys on team juice boxes? This is pretty good. So good, I'm spitting it out. No, it is really good, but I want to keep going. All right. I'll have it later. I'll pick that up later. Hopefully I won't... Uh, I'll pick it up later. Hopefully I won't pick up my sons by accident. All right. Yeah, they're right. So you put it right next to me so I could by accident. Um, okay, the last one... Wait, can I? Yeah. Oh, so it's kind of like a, a chip crisp? Yes. Everything. Everything what we've done is a chip or crisp. What this is... Oh, this should be good as we end. This is assorted club. Assorted baklava. I never know where that's going to go exactly. Woo! This is Jordan's sweetest thanks, flaky. Jordan. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Jordan. Dun, dun. This is his sweetest, flakiest way to break a Ramadan fast. Is that it really is. Right there. This is Jordan's favorite. Actually, we're talking about the country, of course, of Jordan. Um, so anyway, this is Jordan's sweetest, flakiest way to break their fast. Oh, their I fast. thought they were just talking about some random guy named Jordan. No, yeah, this random guy. This is Jordan's favorite. We know some Jordans. Yeah. I didn't know that they knew him. I didn't know they knew him, too. All right. So I think we kind of all know what baklava is. This is mixed baklava. Not exactly sure what mixed means. Um, but baklava is good stuff. Baklava. So, anyway. Whoa. This is kind of like... Good that. stuff. Oh. And this smells incredible. Oh, wow. I can't believe it stayed what? like this. Very Whoa. good. That kind of looks like a bird nest. Oh, yeah, that sure does. And then it comes with this thing. Yeah, a this looks nest. like baklava. This thing looks like a bird looks, nest. Looks like a, I don't even know if I want to eat this. It looks like a bird's nest with little, like, eggs in there. Okay. That is really weird. Uh, every country uh, is probably after us right now. Um, <laughs> no, uh, yeah. We always said one bad thing about I think we're going to lose half our subscribers due to this video. But you know what? These Sorry. are sticky. Sticky. These are sticky. Stickly really? baklava. Da. Ba okay. ba All right, chip it, dip it. Mm. Bird's Very good. nest. You know what? We'll leave that. Exactly. Very good. Thank you, brother. Love you, brother. Say thanks to your uncle. Thanks. Thank you, uncle. Thank you, brother. Thank you, sister. Thank you, niece. Thank you, nephew. We love you guys. Thank you, Big John, uh, for what you gave us uh, as well. Again, this is Universal Sums. Mm. Universal is, Sums. This is Universal Yums, uh, which we got uh, as a gift, which my son got as a gift uh, from his uncle and aunt and niece and nephew. And uh, but you can also and we'll have a, we'll have the link in the description where you also can get a box just like this and you can get one per month. I think that'd be great. All right, quickly, what was your favorite? We don't have to do top three. Do you know due to time, which is we're way over anyway. Get, tell me what your favorite item in the box was. A chip or a crisp or a uh, biscuit with gravy. A biscuit with gravy or a caramel or a fudge. Oh, okay. So basically, you did mine out. You you were pretty much good for everything. My favorite thing by far was Italy's beloved holiday sweet bread called the chocolate cream pandoro. Easily by far, yeah, it's very like good. So good. I very like good. Bread. Very good. Um, the baklava was very good. Didn't try the nest, but the, the baklava was very the good. Nest. Yeah, like, yeah, the bird's nest. Yeah. Really weird. Okay. So those were probably my two biggies. Oh, this chocolate was pretty good, too. Again, I go more savory. Oh, are you on team uh, sweet or savory? That's a good one. Too. I'm on team biscuit. Yep, I thought that. Oh, what about those nacho fries from Taco Bell? Nacho fries. Nacho fries are bad. Yes, yes. <laughs> All right. Hey, we do thank you for being with us. Uh, this was awesome. Uh, you probably, if you're seeing us for the first time, you're like, I want to be a part of that. That is awesome. How can I be a part you of this father and son? Like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the bell for notifications so you guys always get notified whenever we upload a video. 
excellent. We know there's a thousand other channels just like us out there where you can have a lot of fun just like Big John TV and ourselves that do food reviews. But we do thank you for taking a little part of your YouTube experience to hang out with the father and son that love to do what we got to do. And we have a lot of great things uh, this year uh, in store. And so do thank you for being with us. We really do appreciate that. And we got to end quickly here. So as we always end, we'll see you on the food podcast. We'll see you in the next video. All right. Take care. God bless you guys. We love you. Bye.